Christmas, Uncle. I said, Merry Christmas, Uncle. <laughs> humbug. Christmas a humbug, Uncle. Surely you don't mean that. I do. What's Christmas? But a time for buying things for which you have no need, no money. <laughs> time for finding yourself a year older, not an hour richer. <laughs> if I could work my will, every idiot who goes about with Merry Christmas on his lips <laughs> should be boiled in his own pudding <laughs> and buried with a steak of holly through his heart. <laughs> Come now, Uncle. Neville. You keep Christmas in your way and let me keep it in mine. Keep it? But you don't keep it. Let me leave it alone, then. Much good it may do you. Much good it has done you. There are a great many things from which I might have derived good, from which I have not profited, I dare say. Christmas among the rest. But I've always thought of Christmas time when it comes round as a good time, a kindly, forgiving, charitable time. A time when men and women seem by one consent to open their shut-up hearts freely to their fellow creatures. And so Uncle Bert has never put a scrap of gold or silver into my pocket. I do believe that it has done me good. And I say, God bless it. Not a sound from you. And you'll keep your Christmas by losing your situation. 